Alright, gonna get started in just a bit. So yeah, so my team just beat True Vault Hunter mode, and we were all like, yeah, alright, time to move on to Ultimate with this team. It'll be great. And I go to the menu, and it's all like, your choices are Normal Mode, True Vault Hunter mode. There's no Ultimate for me. And it looks like, back here, all the way back here, on the Wildlife Preservation Quest, my internet connection glitches out sometime, and so my friends usually host the game, because it kind of sucks to do it on with me hosting. And it looks like my connection dropped when we were turning in this quest, and so from then on, all the quests were updating for the rest of the team, and not me. So yeah, that kind of sucks. I didn't notice that. So I get to do it on my own, I guess. Which actually isn't like the worst thing ever, because I don't know, I love this game. And I'm not the great, greatest like Maya player ever, but this will give me some practice. Buddy! What the hell are you? Nice thing. Holy scat I'm invisible! This is you! I I can't minion! Gimme five! Oh, right. You learned it! Right. Claptrap can get us through the angels. Oh my god, I'm bad at giving high fives. We may have a way past the bunker. Hey, the bunker. Is that job I think you are going? Look 
if I can just jump over random people. I wish I could do that in real life. That would be really handy. Mordecai got shot in the shoulder and he just hid behind cover and threw Bloodwing out to face those bandits on his own. <laughs> uh, yeah. And Bloodwing just <laughs> around in circles, not attacking anybody. And yep. Mordecai was screaming at him, What are you doing, you coward? Get to kill him! Blah, blah, blah. Yep. And finally Mordecai stood up out and of cover. And Bloodwing went screaming down into the floor yep. and killed all those bandits in a half second. Yeah, he wanted Mordecai to see him do it. Wanted to make him proud. And Mordecai was happy as a skag and slag, kissing his face, <laughs> scratching his neck. Yeah, which would have been cute if Bloodwing hadn't been covered in entrance. Ah, shut up already! <sighs> <laughs> okay, that's actually amazing, because, yeah, I... Oh, I'm a bad person. <laughs> You're amazing. I'm sorry about Bloodwing, soldier. What? But there's still more Wait. to be done if we're going to reach Angel oh. and get the vault key. Oh, okay, I guess I don't have to do all the shit. I just had to turn in this shit and take this note to thousand cuts. <gasps> this oh my gosh, okay. I'm way less annoyed at the game right now. I am way freaking less annoyed at the game. Okay. Thank you, game. Thank you, game. Holy hell. Okay. Oh, I'm caught up. I guess I'm not speedering tonight. Never mind that. Let's let's I'm changing the stream. I'm gonna go fight some pirates. Yeah. Give me one sec to update some shit. to do some art fighting at OP8 because yeah
I really love this DLC. A long time ago, there was a big pile of treasure in the desert, and the Volt Hunters found it and killed all the bad guys. The end. No, 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 that's not how you start a story. I thought it was pretty good. And I think you're not getting fed this week. Now, this is how you start a story. Legends speak of Captain Blade's lost treasure of the sands, of a prize so great that men would turn their sands red in pursuit of it, of a pirate queen, courageous and deadly, who would stop at nothing to find it, of a monstrous leviathan, of the vault hunters who journeyed to the desert town of Oasis, not knowing the horrors that would befall them. See? That's how you do it. Mine was more succinct. Your life's gonna be succinct, you dirty little orphan. I really like this DLC. Nice. I should actually get prepared for this. I keep uh, resetting lately. I mean, my friend's been farming a lot of stuff, and I just love this DLC. Like, you can never get too many just like pimpernels and sandhogs and all this good stuff. Everything's really great. Now known to me. Also, pimpernels are amazing. Yeah, the Pimpernel is such a ridiculous weapon. It's so great. Like, I'm one-shotting things. At OP8. Ah, I'm really glad that- okay, I thought- I was so sad, I thought- that would've been really annoying if, uh, my Maya really had to do all that stuff again. Like, not the worst. Oh god, my computer's telling the me to go to bed. The time is 9.30 p.m. I'm, I'm going to ignore it. You need to get to bed. I know, so you can get I know, sleep. I know. Turn my computer nags me to, start to go down. the fuck to bed, and I'm not gonna listen to it. Because I don't have to go to work until kinda late tomorrow, and that's pretty great. But yeah, it's gonna, like, pull focus again in just a bit, so... I may die. That's cool. Stinkbot? Maybe? I mean, 
Chat in person, like people. Oasis. Huh. Oh, is that a fool hmm. hunter I see? I'm Captain Scarlet, and something tells me you're here for the treasure, same as I am. So, we've got two options. We can work together and split the treasure, or we can just try to kill one another. Or maybe both. Come huh. find me in Wormwater, yeah? Yeah. I am Shade, and you, you are the coolest person I have ever seen. Please don't go. Please. No. The townspeople of Oasis, thank you. If you're looking for the treasure of the Sands, you want to talk to Captain Scarlet. She's set up in Wormwater. You'll need a sand skip to reach her. Use mine. It's the least I can do for the stranger who saved the many living people of my town. Oh, you're so cool. I am so cool. You can never be too well armed. I know. I'm holding accent things for accent. Boss cannon. It shoots bosses out of it. All these things. I was going through Digistar Peak with some friends earlier. On OP7. Unlocked OP8 for a friend. That was fun. I actually haven't done this DLC on my own. I've been running it like a zillion times with my friend who plays uh, just fast accent, accent with the speed glitch like really well, which is like really, really fun. Although she like plays it at like, well, she started out at like level 66. Um, although she finally got up to 72. Um, so I'm also used to the enemies being in like two-player mode in this and me having to kill like almost all of them. So this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be like breeze, although I'm gonna get half as much stuff, which is a little sad. And also, I don't know shit about what order to like talk to people in and all that, so there's gonna be some of me like wandering around, because normally fax stacks and like does the things, and I'm like, whoa. He did the things real fast. And she's like, yep, playing fast accident. Yeah, she normally runs around and gets all things, you know, I walk out there and get the guy to run there. And the sandworm tries to meet me and it's all nice. Oh my word. Oh. A new person has left a to come talk to me. Mrs. Blavis, be careful. She is a relentless flirt. I always feel like a piece of meat around her. I gave her a coolant disperser several weeks ago as a gift. What Take a nice it. gift. Could I please be getting surprised with that shake? You Raven is oh, I this is the thing I don't know what to do. Okay. Oh, it's the <gasps> heart. Right. Only a few more sand skip parts, and you'll be on your way to Captain Scarlet and the Lost Treasure. How fun if you'll be leaving me alone. <laughs> Doesn't know, beard. Hi there, Dan. I'm Jennifer. Clothes and boys in high school and gossip. <laughs> That's Jennifer. A nice girl, but very naive. I think she has a magnetic overthruster you could use for the sand skiff. That was easy. They call me Jocko the Joker. I'm a laugh a minute. Hey, what's the difference between a stag and a lack of water? 
there isn't one because they'll both kill you. <laughs> Oh, gosh, Jocko. Jocko borrowed one of my pressure regulators for one of his comedy bits the other day. Find it, and it is yours. That thing up there. How the fuck do I get up there? Of death on me because those are the worst. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna get murdered by being spit on by a sandworm at least several times. to digit scanner into the catch a ride system. If you want. Scan me. There. You may now destruct a sand skiff from any catch a ride machine. Before you go off to meet Captain Scarlet though, you must return to me. The true world revealed. Weakness is now known to me. Time to go to work. I had no reason to call you back. I just enjoyed your presence. Yeah. Captain Scarlet has been tracking the treasure of the sands for several years. You should sail out to meet her in your sand skiff. Okay, before I go though, there's like another quest here I want to pick up.
with Kanai. Soccer's been pretty great. Is that a rabbit? No. Oh yeah! Hi! Alright. Someone's watching. these with the wrestlers prefix because it like doubles the damage but the odds of that are really freaking rare oh hey got a knife on it fantastic was caught stealing from the treasure hole so I had to pretend to kill him to keep the rest of the crew in line gave him enough cash to disappear shot him overboard with a blank Keeping up this face, some Captain Blade retains a hell of a lot of work. I like Captain Blade. Also, yeah, I'm playing on PC. That's the other thing that's probably gonna happen to me a lot. I'm gonna just like have sandworms spawn right in my face and my boat will explode and it will be sad times. Wait, you're going now? We were just Bye. One of these days, I really freaking want the Rustler's Orphan Maker, because, like, the Rustler's prefix adds, uh, pretty sure it just, like, adds two extra pellets to it, but it starts with two pellets, so it pretty much just, like, it's a prefix that doubles the damage on that gun, and you're supposed to be able to do some, like, pretty wacky things with that. One of these days, I'm just gonna have to, like, reset over and over until I get that. Today is not that day. I should leave this hand on the line. What am I doing? Coming from Oasis. That's a. Alright, well. Sandman wants your part of the compass, bitch. Hand it over. And I'm being attacked. Oh. Great. Wonderful. Hey, stranger, you give me a hand oh, with Sandman's boys. I'll make it worth your while, alright? Oh, 
Oh god, my boat is in real bad shape right now. <laughs> this could suck. Oh, I'm recovering. Alright. Taking so long. Normally, the wind goes faster, which it shouldn't because not only I'm a two player. Ah, uh, you have wrestlers, that's awesome. Nice moves out there. You're a vault hunter, yeah? Never met one of you guys before. The guns, the power, it's all very striking. If you're looking for the treasure of the sands, you've come to the right chick. But, gah, I'm being rude. I haven't even introduced myself to that a lot. Sorry. I'm, um, Captain Scott. Yeah, I played through this like six or seven times with a friend and at OP8, and we haven't nice gotten to wrestlers yeah. yet. And I'm just gonna have to reset, like, for it. A bunch of times. I don't know. My, my my friends I play with me were like weirdly legit in how we get our gear. Like we don't duplicate things or my friends don't even reset. Like that's gonna be me pushing a little bit. I really want a wrestlers. The great thing though is I've got like this huge Pimpernel collection from doing this DLC a whole lot. I have even more, but they're in storage. Right, I should pr So the legends say that whoever gets all four pieces of a mystical compass will find the lost treasure. I've got a piece, because I'm awesome, but Sandman has one too. Head to Hater's Folly, kill Sandman, and get his piece of the compass. Sound good? Sound good. Awkward jump. Oh this is another bit where my friend uses a fast accent thing usually just runs like hell and I'm like getting in my boat and then it's just like, oh, surprise, we're there. So, let me cruising around a little bit and like, where the fuck am I actually going? Oh, yeah, we have just have to head back to Oasis and probably should have just teleported back there a while. works too. <laughs> yeah, the Pimpernel is freaking amazing. Like, oh god, I'm switching worms again. are amazing. You've really got this pirate thing out. Wee. If you're wondering why I'm sending you to kill 
kill Sandman rather than do it myself. First of all, good question. Glad to see you, you know, taking the initiative. Second of all, Sandman's pretty strong and you're expendable as hell, so good luck. <gasps> Thank you, Scarlet. Oh, You just exploded. <laughs> I really like being able to just one shot things in OP8 with Pimpernel. Shots. Yeah, like being able to proc four on single target sometimes with this is pretty freaking awesome. I'm getting better at my aim, I think. I'm definitely not like the best player ever, but I'm decent. I love this game. It's here. Let's see how I do here. My friend is always like, oh hey, it's the place where you die a lot. So there's that. Although I think I'm actually getting better. This place. Oh sorry, I hacked into your echo device shortly after we met, so I can see everything you can. I get horrifically bored, and it's fun to watch you kill people. This is really pretty. I oh, love this game. And you have all of them. I'm still, I'm still working on it. I've got zero is my first to OP8. I've nearly got my Salvador there, and I've also got a uh, Psycho at the level cap. Working on uh, my uh, an Axton, and I haven't played Gage yet, but I want to. Yeah, that's my goal to like get everybody to OP8 eventually. Just got zero. Yeah, my Salvador is at OP7. It's really sad. Um, 
but actually I think tomorrow my friends that I play with, we're gonna try and do that run. We've been doing like one, uh, I think was. Did you start peak run per day? Oh, awkwardly. But yeah, I think tomorrow night we're doing we're trying to get myself a Draco of the Eight, so that'll be fun. We just got my friend Siren. Yeah, Gage. Gage is kind of interesting. Like, she seems really unusual. One of my friends played Gage on like my very first run through the game. Besides from that, like. I really like accuracy, so I'm always like... I'm just gonna try and get through here as fast as possible and avoid these gags, which is kind of cheap, but... I really don't like dealing with skag packs. <laughs> Oh, hi, rabbit gag. Wow, alright, I am not pulling this off very well. But... Rabbit's gag, eat those people. I'm out. to have a grog nozzle and then I don't. Gage can do some like really freaking ridiculous things at OPA too, just like the whole like sham plus Norfleet thing, which is seems a little silly, but also kind of awesome. Also, Death Trap gets into cutscenes, which is like the best thing ever. and uh, the whole like sad bit with Roland's death and all we just like we're at the point where we just try and get like weird shit in that cutscene and she managed to summon death trap like right before the cutscene <laughs> and so handsome Jack shot death trap in the cutscene and it was like the greatest thing I've ever seen I was very happy these guys.
moment. And yeah, the, the very final end of the game, like in the after defeating the warrior, you can get just like infinite death trap because it just like sits there and murders the racks and kind of recharges itself. So it's just like if you summon death trap there, death trap's just gonna be there, and then it lasers hands and Jack in the face, which is amazing. So it got revenge. Not good, not good. That dude exploded. I may be going down because crows and dots suck at OP8 so much. No, I'm just gonna mark it, so. Oh. Oh! Alright. Yeah, I got this Norfleet the very first time I killed Hyperius at OP8, and I'm like so freaking pleased with myself. That was really lucky. I'm probably going to get really, like, awkwardly murdered by Sandman, too, because that's... That just happens to me. I'd find that box. Oh, shit. That's grenades. That's more grenades. I need to get rid of that exploding guy. Oh man, the 94% sham. Yeah. Well, good luck. Like, I haven't done actually like a ton of bunker farming. I've only gotten a couple shams, but that's something I want to do. Cause yeah, my stu my zero, I keep uh, I keep resetting cause um, I've been farming pimpernels and stuff with my friends. So I'm still like at the very beginning of the storyline in terms of just like where I'm at right now with what my zero can get to. I'm really excited. I really hope that I get my Salvador to OP8 tomorrow night, because then I'll, he's got the whole story unlocked, so he'll be able, able, or able to at least like farm some stuff for me, like the stuff that you need to be further in the story. But yeah, um, I'm really excited. My friends and I are planning to do like an OP8 completionist run coming up soon, which is some why we've been farming stuff, because just got to OP8 for the first time recently. Uh, but we're gonna try and do like everything, and it's gonna be super fun. Oh man, the other thing I've been going for for farming is the twister lately, and oh my god, that is like the worst freaking thing ever to farm. Um, you ever gone after the twister? Because it's in the um, Hammerlock Game Hunt DLC, like you have to like get witch doctors to level up like the badass savages. And there's like this tiny little chance that they turn into the uh, triple O, or I don't even know how to pronounce the, what the actual name is. And it's supposed to have like a like a one in two or three chance of dropping a twister, which is like this amazing shotgun. But I've summoned it like four times and no twister yet. I got an interface though, that was really cool. Uh, yeah, not elemental, which is a little sad, but yeah, I got this to drop from triple O, which kind of neat. Prefer it if it was like fire. Okay, I'm gonna get murdered by Sandman. You really should have died when I told you. 
this is how this fight goes. Like, I kill everything, and then I go after Sandman, and then he, like, scoots back really awkwardly and hides and puts me in a fight for my life. And he's freaking hiding again, it's annoying. So, let's see if I can do better this time. Badass, and I disappear. This part's no problem. It's just freaking wiggly little dude. The guy behind him, at least. Okay, can I? Wonder if. Ah, shit. Yep, this is how it goes. I hate this. Oh, bore him. Bore him. Please, please. Okay. Yes. Okay. Alright. Actually, we're alright. Thanks. Slightest idea where the other two pieces are, but you know, it's a start. Part of me feels kind of bad I didn't get to kill Sandman myself. But the other part of me is happy I got to chill back here and read the latest issue of Crime Fighter Frog. It's about a frog. Oh, you have a twister. That's awesome. Yeah, that's like... Huh. One of these days, I'm gonna get one. Yeah, it took me like freaking two hours to get Triple O to spawn last time I tried. I did it like... Um, the whole thing where you can like start summoning dicks to do us the invincible and all that. And then you get a good wave for like of enemies before him for farming stuff. Yeah. I know where the third compass piece is. Iberian's got it. Judging by what they've been saying. But he didn't drop it. He dropped it in her facer. They're gonna ship it out on a caravan and I was sad and happy all at once. Because hey interface. That jackass from Oasis is coming after me. BRB diary. Well, that's lucky. Oh, you got it! That's so that's amazing. Third compass piece and be that much yeah. closer to finding the treasure. Well, hey, congratulations. That's like super awesome. Oh. Where's the thingy? I, have, I should. Might as well try and get a grape here while I'm here, just in case I can get the slag one. I already have one. One of my friends. I, oh, I think I probably have it in my. Yeah, I think I'm in storage. But I actually got a slag OP8 one the other day, and my friend got one too. But I usually play in a group of three. And my friend who doesn't have one mains Creek, so. Let's work the bottle down here, right? Yeah. Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I agree with your group. Triple O is the freaking worst. <laughs> yeah, after after this last time I tried, like, I was I was so excited to get Triple O, so I like called my friends to fight him. It was the first time I'd done it with the like exiguous method. And so then we all decided like fuck it, we're all fighting exiguous and whoa. Ooh. Ooh. Us? 
kind of neat. I mean, it's just little percent buffs, but hey. Yeah, actually, I really freaking like the Legendary Hunter mod, um, which really surprises me, because I was like, when I was looking at the Legendary mods, I was just like, well, Legendary Killer is obviously the best, because it buffs, like, so many useful things. Like, the skill points are slightly bullshit on Legendary Hunter, but it's just like, the cooldown rate is just super fun, and critical damage and reload speed are pretty nice. And, I don't know, it's like not the best for damage, and I switch around with like Legendary Sniper or Legendary- I, I haven't played much Melee Zero yet, but I actually really- like Legendary Hunter was just like a pleasant surprise, and I find myself using it a lot, because cooldown's super fun, so alright. Oh, hey, Captain Scarlet picture. How lovely. Um, so, wow, alright, I'm real happy, I found something cool, I guess. Probably gonna be normal. Crew, we're gonna mutiny. It's the normal. To kill. It's rabbit. They I don't know what that prefix does. But hey. After they strung him up, they got to talking. Found out I'd never killed another soul in my life. My guess is they'll raid the treasure room for guns and shoot me when my back's ten. <gasps> Might as well do it. Huh. Rather be killed than have to wipe out my own men. And this should be my Last log entry. Captain Blade, signing off. I like Captain Blade. The time is 10 15 oh, p.m. Start to wrap up to get what you are doing and, and get ready for it. bedtime. Shush, computer. Oh, probably shouldn't stay up too much later. I don't know. I'm rebelling against my own alarm system that I made for myself. I'm like, yeah, I'll make a sensible alarm system and go to bed early. I'm like, here, tell me to go to bed, it's gonna be great. And... Oh. Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> I like these Buccaneer guys. They're like, trying their best. Another one of those things where I normally run this with my friend who plays Speed Glitch Action. <sighs> and they take me to the blazes. Pack up the camera. Yes, shush. a.m. for you. It's only like it's only 10 p.m. for me right now, so it's not that late for me. I got work tomorrow, but it's like starting later because it's Easter, so I can actually stay up. I don't know. Gotta get that sham. Oh man. I, yeah. 
once I'm actually to that part in the story again where I can fight the bunker, I will go and bore that thing and get good champ. Because yeah, I've gotten a couple champs and they've all been shitty and... Well, I haven't gotten any OP8 ones yet, so I gotta do that. I really need better bones of the ancient steel. Mine are kind of on the crappy side. Let me know if anything catches your eye. Shoot everything in the crotch for great success. Who's that? Who's the T-Dirt shield? Oh man, I got... Love the antagonist shield. That is a good shield. That's a really determined floater. Or not, not that determined, I guess. Did he get tired? Come on, you can do it. He got this. Come on, like get me. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Oh god. It's, this, this is gonna be a terrible decision. Wait, are you- what are you- what are you doing? Oh. That- I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Come on, buddy. You got this. <laughs> is it like trying to get to me and not- not my boat? I think it's like trying to get to me and then just being like, damn, I can't get close enough, this boat's in the way. <laughs> this is amazing. Wow, it's got friends. I'm totally about to like regret this and die, but... Oh, come on, come on, buddies. You got this, you got this. <laughs> so like... What? What is your deal? 
Increasing aggression? No, you're really not. I've got hood ornaments now. Oh, there they go. I really like this loader. Here, come with, no, come with me. Come with me. Not surrender. You, you, you too. Strange little thing. Oh well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you live. I like those guys. They were good floaters. I made some friends. Is, but I know someone who might. His name is Herbert, and he lives out in the rust yards. Take that gift box over there. <laughs> Tail that exploded that lid. Yeah. Hold on to that gift box and don't give it to Herbert. I was really hoping I could just like take them along with me, like have them be a good heart hood ornament. Oh man! Speaking of that, when I was playing Krieg, one of my friends realized that she could just like push me on the front of the boat as a hood ornament, and that was good times. Oh yes, and off, yes. I really wish elemental sand hawks were more common. Like, oh man, some of why me and my friend like ran this a bunch of times is we wanted a corrosive one for the peak, and we finally got one. But it took like forever. Like I, I didn't mind. I was like super happy to just be like, yes, let's do this DLC a million times. I'm just gonna hoard all the pimpernels and have a great time. Even once complete, the compass still needs to be taken to a very super secret location before it will reveal where Blade's treasure is buried. You can rest easy for now. Oh, there he is! There he is! Hey, buddy. You're just chilling. I I really like you. I'm still gonna leave you alone. All right. You got. Oh, good. You have a friend. I have a bunch of friends. More friends are coming here. You've totally got this little exploder. Hope you have a great rest of your day. Don't explode horribly. I should just like I'm gonna, I'm gonna pretend my uh, 1340 shotgun is just that particular exploder. Actually, that makes no sense. I love the tacky shotgun. Oh, I should actually put my fire stuff. Wait for friends. I can just like book it. Ha! Take that. <laughs> Herbert, the guy you're looking for, I brought him on board a few months back because he's stupidly knowledgeable about Captain Lady's treasure. Then I kicked him off because you'll, you'll see. Can't I just like snipe Herbert from here and then we just go take his stuff? Oh, if Herbert asks about me, don't say anything. Did I just slag myself with my shield? I think I did. Goodbye. Or a magic missile. I slag myself.
Ouch. It's another one of you, Dirks. I can keep my just like, oh, it's a trick. Yeah. Yeah, it is. <laughs> you got it? Oh my god, congratulations. That is freaking awesome. Nice. How long did that take you? That's got, I mean, that's got to take a while. That's awesome. The time is 10.30 p.m. Oh, my computer's telling me it's good. The ocean yeah, yeah. noises will no. start playing in 15 Shush minutes. Computer. Good yeah, night, space robots and rats. May you have pleasant dreams. Well, I'm really I'd listen. The work's starting late tomorrow. go for a bunker. <laughs> I mean, I can't. I'm not at that point in the story right now, but I would... I'm just like, man. I want to do that. Be boring and just sneak past these people because I'm tired. 
upgrade. If I can get on the freaking ladder, I'm definitely tired. Wow. All right. To get an OP8 Herald too. That's another thing I gotta go for. Mine is seven. Meet this asshole now. Hold on. Hold on a second. Scarlet? Is that you? This game could use some lasers. The pre sequel's got lasers. And I can take really kind of need to have some lasers in here. She wants the last compass piece, doesn't she? Oh, yeah. Let's talk, you and me. Let's not. Fine, fine, fine. If I help you, Scarlet, go in your house. So oh. 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 Right. Squeak with them. Not sword with them. Squeak with all. I haven't found the rest of these. I gotta find more of those. The tapes. <sighs> yes. Get the tape. Get the tapes. I'll mark them. Showing the chat, which is went away. One sec. Come on. Wake up, iPad. Oh, there it goes. Alright. Tails from the Does Tails have lasers in it? 
I... I don't remember. I need to play Tales more. I've played it through, like, once. It was fun times. The only problem is, it's like... I wanted to get in there and, like, shoot stuff. <laughs> Some of the places looked kind of fun. Sleep. Oh, I gotta remember to give Sandy his medicine. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> oh well, I'm dead. Hi, <laughs> you're dead too. <laughs> Please, spider ants, come join me. That's why I was good. The rats are just chilling in the rat cage. I think they're asleep. I am standing on like a precarious ledge here. Thinking about mortality. Goodbye, cruel world. <clears throat> Spider ants got me. Gravity got me. That was a good death. Oh, you're still alive. You just set off my trap car. Your death approaches. Another thing where my friend plays Axton, and one of the recent times she came here, somehow I forget, I don't know what the fuck she did, but she managed to like fly through the air across this area, and it like counted as getting this tape. It was really weird. I was very confused. dead. I need to back the hell up from finding those fire ants. <gasps> Otherwise they're gonna throw me off a cliff again. <gasps> and that looks like... Whoa. <sighs> I was worried something like this would happen. Just collect his little love letters as quick as you can, sorry. What the hell just happened? The boat just like explode. Why? Who stores love letters on an exploding boat? That guy. Huh. 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 
Scarlet. I wrote you a haiku. <clears throat> you got a nice butt. You also got a nice chest. Your face is okay to... No! Six syllables! Oh, it's ruined! God damn it! That's what you get for trying to, like, steal my haiku game. Oh, hey, it's the other part where I die a lot. Oh. Hey, hey, fun times. What did I say? Woo. Can I get through here without dying permanently? Or dying fully? If I'm cheap, then no, I'm gonna die. Almost there. Oh, no. Alright, Norfleet. Surprising me. That's nice. Yeah. I'm a little shitty at this area. Wooden pirate ship. Oh, it's actually. Oh god, don't let me fall off this cliff. Yeah, these are actually like I think these are like old doll company ships. There's like they're not actually well. Okay, some of them are weird wooden ships. That that I'll give you that. But there, are... yeah, there's a bunch of like awesome ships that are just like. I think this place dried up and it like stranded all these weird ships here. Makes them some kind of neat levels. Like, yeah, one of the areas that we fought through before was like the insides of one of those ships. Huh. And there's this here oh. ship, which, yeah, people live in now, and these people oh. are really good at murdering me. is playing soothing ocean noises at me in its like valiant final attempt to get to me to go to bed and I'm not listening so why this place gets me. It's just like, stuff is, I don't know, tight spaces, lots of enemies. I have not figured out like a graceful way through here yet. I could probably play more cautious, but it's Borderlands. There was a young man from Nantucket who got limericks and haikus confused. I like it. Stop being aggroed, people. I'm... Oh god! Oh, I'm so screwed. <laughs> oh my crap. <laughs> oh my god, I hate this fucking thing so much. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. I'm running away. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> 
my god. Why did it do that to me? Game. Please. Did I, did I at least... Well, bye. I guess. Yeah, Cursed Pirates, you like have to stay away from them because they, uh... I should actually get rid of that freaking turret I'm using something sensible. And not wasting all my North Fleet ammo. Or Pimpernel. Wow, I'm tired apparently. How hilarious. You just <laughs> set off my Cursed Pirates are scary, man! <laughs> I'm just like, uh... Don't like it. Out here. That actually might be a sensible thing for me to do. They can just live in their little happy boathouse. And I. will bravely run away, like Sir Robin. Take number 48. Same with all you people. I'm just. I just want a sand talk. Leave me alone. I actually have to remember to pick up the tapes and not like leave that up to my friends. Because she is oh. not here. Uh -huh. Today's Scarlet Carl Wait, where is the other tape actually? So honorable. Is it here? Do I actually have to kill everything? As she ran him through with her sword, I knew. Okay. Somewhere here. She's the one. <gasps> That's right up there. Okay. That's not so bad. Okay, this is mistake number 206. I call this one Scarlet. I would like to touch you in places. Oh, Scarlet. Oh, God. Did you find one of his songs? Musical gonorrhea. Still, you found all of his tapes. Better return them to him and wash your hands afterward. Ugh. <laughs> I love all the, like, dots after me. Yep, I'm just no fan out of here. You all fight with each other. I do not need the experience points. I just want to go fast and get my thing. Man, there's like a good battle going on on that ship now. You found the tapes? Once you deliver those with the last piece of the compass, Scarlet will have to take me back. The last compass piece is in that chest. All right, gonna open this chest, get the last piece. It's gonna go great. Ah, must be rusty, rusty, rusty. Just 
shoot the lock. Okay. Oh, your shot destroyed the last piece of the legendary compass. Whoops. 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 Looks like when you whoops. shot the lock, Plus the, whoops. the final compass piece into bits. Chapters okay, whoops. This is bad. Um, no, wait. I can make a replacement. I just need parts. Just get to the Washburn refinery. Go, go, go. Trying to think if I should keep playing, but it's nearly 11 here. I love Washburn Refinery though, it's like one of my favorite places. And uh... I should probably call it a night. So yeah, I'm super happy that Mamaya didn't actually glitch out and have to do the whole last half of the game again, because... That's why I logged on in the first place. I was like, shit, I have to do all these quests. But no, the game is way better designed than that. And I just had to do one quest that I missed with my team on my own. And after I turned that on in, it was like, hey, you're all caught up. And I was like, yay, all right. Then I felt like playing, so I went to fight pirates because I really love this DLC and it has great rewards. But yeah, I do have work tomorrow, so I think I'm gonna sign off. Hey, Captain Scarlet, we broke your last compass piece. You're welcome. I'll try and find another time soon to like finish playing through this DLC, because I want my things. I need a sand top and another pimpernel and all those great things that drop in this DLC. What are you doing, random person? That was a good evening. I made friends with some exploders. That was probably the most exciting thing that happened. <gasps> Alright, so good night everybody. I'll probably be doing the rest of this some other time.